<laughs> so apparently, Kate Michelle was on Instagram going back and forth with her fans, mm -hmm. and someone called her a wannabe Dage Loaf. For some reason, she just came out of nowhere and was like, I want to sleep with Dage Loaf. Okay. I don't know. D Dage Loaf is like, Dage Loaf like a sexy skinny young boy. Shit. You think she's sexy? When she like, when she like dressed like girly, yeah, I know. You know, the crazy thing with Days Loaf, like how we was introduced to Days Loaf, she was talking about shooting niggas with Max and Tex. <laughs> and I was just thinking to myself, like, I'm not buying into no chick that be like, you know, I got the Mac and the Tommy. Like, when you just sing about guns like that, I just, I'm not, I don't believe you. Cause like, let me you catch your body. Yeah, just try me, try me. <laughs> you gotta kill your whole motherfucking family. <laughs> no. <laughs> I wasn't buying this shit from Days Loaf any fucking way. You didn't think she was gonna kill your whole family. You like how she made that round though. She's family. Listen, man, all Days Loaf. Nah, I'm gonna chill. I'm gonna just say like I wasn't buying Days Loaf. So when Days Loaf started to act a little bit more feminine, and I was like, ah, that's the Days Loaf that I want. That I've been here to come to see. You know what I'm saying? So if Days Loaf and K Michelle fuck, I mean, more power to him. I would like to be there. Mm. Or even videotape it. Think that would be a good, a great seller. What? A videotape of K. Michelle and Dej Love? Not really. <laughs> I don't nobody care about K. Michelle no more. She done took the ass implants out and the titty implants. Well, she out. did it for her health. It's cool, but now you now you don't have a fat ass. Nobody gives a fuck about you. Yeah, but right? it's about her singing talent. Nobody gave a fuck about her singing talent. We only cared that she had a fat ass. We. Don't say all of us. Oh. People don't like me cared. You're a liar. I cared about the songs that she sung. While she was, while her back was turned to the camera. Absolutely not. Okay, solid. It's not what I did. Okay. Do you believe me? No. Why the fuck would I ever believe you? Because I'm light skin. That's why I don't. <laughs> <sighs> so, so do you, would you still... Would you still listen to her music even though she doesn't have an ass mm -mm. anymore? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. So that's the only thing that was bringing you to the table? You lied to me in the beginning anyway because I thought the ass was real. I just thought she was some cornbread fed down south chick. I mean, I think her ass was just a little too big. No, I... I I've to be seen, real. Person. I've seen little short chicks like K. Michelle with real fat asses that was real. So I just thought... Okay, K. Michelle, you got all this fucking turkey. And then to find out it was fake and it was just bullshit. And there's too much with K. Michelle, man. Like, I got like, I, I can't ever say I ever bought any of K. Michelle music, but I liked her ass. So, so if she walked through the door right now, you would turn her away? Turn her away like she wanted to chew my dick or something? I wouldn't you know, say. Are we allowed to say that like she wanted to chew my dick? <laughs> he can bleep it out. Oh, okay. She wanted to give you oral relations. So, if K. Michelle walks to the door and says, Yes, Barksdale, I want to chew your dick. Oral relations. And so, you want to know what I'm going to do. Yes, would you, would you push her away? Yes, because I'm spoken for. Good job. <laughs>